Hey guys, it is Sabrina here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new, thank you for stopping by and checking out my video. As you can tell by the caption, I have another uh, thrifting haul. I'm not doing too good about my no spend. Um, if you don't know what's going on, you can watch my last video. Basically talked about how I didn't want to really spend any money. I just wanted to save money. No thrifting, no shopping, just things that I necessarily need um, and then things that I had planned on buying if they had came in stock otherwise no shopping but I went shopping it I, I blame work um apparently I went over on my hours and they let me go home early and I got done at 4 30 daycare is open until six o'clock so your girl took some time to herself and did some thrift shopping. So um, I went to Goodwill, and then there's a local thrift store that I got one item from. Um, so we'll go ahead and we'll just get started. We'll just do clothing first and then the accessories after. Um, so the first thing that I found was this. <clears throat> this is the Olivia and Sky. Uh, this is like in olive, like military green color. It's one of those nice, uh, very loose materials. Uh, I can wear it with, uh, as a tunic with some boots, leggings, and just some like additional cute accessories. So this was $4.45 and then it was 50% off. So I did pay the 50% off price. So that is the one item that I got at the thrift store that is not Goodwill. Um, I really, really went hardcore on 50% off items and the clearance items, so I'm just going to share a couple of things. Um, we'll do the 50% off first, and then we will do the clearance. So, um, we will start off with this jockey tank top. It's going to be one of these slim fitting tank tops. I got it in a size medium. Um, really sucks everything in and smooths everything out. I learned that uh, very fast. Um, so, this was $5.99. And then again, it was this was 50% off. Does have the jockey um, label on there, and barely looks like there's any really wear. Um, there's a few letters missing, but overall, pretty solid, good condition. So good deal for 50% off. The next item that I have, and you guys are gonna have to help me out because. I am now 100% sure if I like this color. It is a Banana Republic uh, wool sweater. This was $6.99, so it was 50% off. The only thing that it got me was that it is the Banana Republic, but it is the black tag. Um, and this is 100% merino wool. So I'm not entirely sure if this is like there's the outlet, there's a regular, and then the higher end of different brands like this. So I wasn't sure because it is 100% wool if it is one of those higher up brands. Um, and with it being the $6.99 and the 50% off, I thought I would pick it up. So if any of you thrifters know, please let me know down in the comments if I found a good deal or not. The next 50% item that I have is another Banana Republic item. This is the Banana Republic Mad Men. Also has the black tag. Um, it is this cheetah print scarf. Let's, let, me, let me put it on the right way, you guys, so you can have a better idea. Um, as I was folding it and examining it more, it does have a snag in it, um, but it is a super pretty, like neutral cheetah print color the ends do have like that fraying texture so i'm not sure if that's how it's supposed to be or if it's just wear and tear from it um, being used at the thrift store but i thought this scarf was super super cute this was 2.99 and it was 50 percent off so i thought this was a super good deal um so yeah let me know too about the black tay because um, I really like this. I think it'd be super cute for me to wear to work. I really want to get into that like that neutral uh, color scheme um, and just really up my wardrobe. So this is super cute, but if I don't wear it, I need to know uh, what a good price range would be to sell it for. Um, and then the last uh, pink item, pink tag item that was 50% off were these American Eagle boots. So 
Um, I used to have a lot of pair of riding boots and they just normal wear and tear um, wore out. I have a pair of black boots, but I've been wanting a pair of brown boots. So these are a size eight. These are the American Eagle brand. These were $7.99 and they were 50% off. So super cute staple, just a plain brown boot. But I mean, for $5, how can you go wrong? And then I have two clearance items. This first one I was kind of like on the fence about because I don't really know if it's 100% my style. Um, but I thought with high-waisted jeans, it would look super, super cute. So this is the top. Um, it is H&M. This was on clearance for $1.99. So it's going to have like this, I guess you would call it embroidery or just like lace design that's going to cover like the upper part of your chest and then your arms. So you'd want to wear this with like a, probably like a neutral bralette or maybe a bandeau. And I thought with some high-waisted jeans, this was like super cute, um, especially if I paired it with like the boots or something. So I picked this up. Um, and this next item I am like dying for because I really want just want to know more information on it. Um, so I'm looking at it and I see this tag, you guys. So right away I'm thinking, is this from Anthropology or Urban Outfitters? Let me check the RN tag. So immediately I'm like getting all up in here looking for the tag. And our end number 66170. So it is either Anthropology or it is from Urban Outfitters. And it is this gray knit kind of like tunic, but it could also be as like a sweater dress. It does have a long sleeve. And this is the design on the back. This is a size medium, super, super cute. And you'll be blown away by how much I paid for it. $4. I think that is insane for something that could be at Anthropology or Urban Outfitters. And I paid 4 bucks for it on clearance. Thank you, Goodwill. This is super, super cute on. So I'm going to probably be looking into it to see if it's worth um, a higher retail. Uh, if I wanted to sell it or if I wanted to keep it. Because it is in that neutral uh, color zone that I've been wanting to strive for. And the last item I have been on the, hurts, blah, 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 on the hunt for, I went to Elite, which is a sporting goods store in my local town. And I'm like, hey, I know this is probably impossible to find, but I need a pair of plain sweatpants. I don't want joggers. I don't want cuffs at the end. I just want plain sweatpants that are going to fit me comfortably. I don't have to worry about anything riding up, anything being too tight. I just need a plain pair of comfortable sweatpants. Of course, I couldn't find any. Went to the max men's section. They have North Face fleece sweatpants. I want fleece sweatpants. I want normal sweatpants. And they had Jordan ones. Does your girl look like a Jordan girl? No. So... I, when I go through a shading, I still go through a lot of um, the, my sizes anyways that I normally wear just because if I see something that sparks my interest, if I see something that's on a really good deal, something I'm looking for that I have in the back of my head, and your girl found it. So I found a pair of these Under Armour, I cannot believe it, a pair of Under Armour sweatpants plain pair of sweatpants they have like the thicker band down at the bottom which is awesome i'm so pumped about the nice under armor material and your girl got a normal pant leg i am so excited for these so these were a little bit higher um these were 8.99 but for something that i have been on the hunt for and literally cannot find anywhere without paying like 60 dollars for a pair of sweatpants $8.99 will be just dandy. So, that is everything that I got in my little haul. Um, and hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. For sure, leave me a comment down below what your favorite item was. 
things that you are looking for thrifting and what you know about those banana public black tags so um thank you again for tuning into my video and i hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day and i will see you guys later bye